what's up everyone and welcome back to the channel thank you for dropping by and thank you for watching jane alaska here in this channel we talk about lifestyle and sneaker related stuff and if you are new to this channel please consider subscribing and today's episode is another unboxing and foot review of one of the very iconic sneaker of the nike air max we got the nike air max one boom wow so here we go so i was so lucky and so happy to have this one in the collection because i don't have one uh, air max one in the collection so far and you know me i would like to have a a sneaker that i would love to have in the collection especially i like the color a combination of the color and most of all the price which is not i'm not breaking the band to have a, a sneaker collection that i really really <laughs> like it the one that i really like the most on um, this air max one it is very trendy very unique and um, very classic silhouette very simple yet iconic this air max one is setting it apart from the og nike air max one is the use of high quality and durable materials in the upper that ensures a luxe finish and a stylish look the nike air max one Running shoe also features a visible air bubble cushioning that gives the shoe improved stability and lightweight comfort. Also, this sneaker is known for its durable rubber waffle outsole, which provides the shoe with enhanced traction. The price is very worth on this one, especially about them uh, below retail, but the quality materials that they made is um, mostly dominant with a suede and the toe box with this black suede and a little bit on um, the gray suede right here this one is um, a leather and the white swoosh a different leather and we got also a suede that goes around the uh, back of the ankle and also a nice tan. really a minimalist but fashionable color you can't go wrong on this color aside from air cushioning technology in the shoe sole the air max one also had the pu midsole that provides additional comfort the sneaker tongue and also the padded collar right here it is really comfortable the interior is lined with breathable material for lockdown support and superior ventilation and as you can see right here the mesh material make it more breathable and had a good ventilation this air max one is very versatile shoe that can be worn uh, running or walking and as i mentioned also it has some kind of adequate support and very comfortable sneaker sizing wise it is true to size with the sizing two things that i cons that i would say is it is a little bit bulky as you can see right here and not much bulky but a little bit and also the toe box it is um, a little bit narrow as you can see so this could be a um, probably main issue for a wide foot but for me uh i just mentioned one of those review i would like to have a little bit uh, room on my finger on my foot so it can play around a little bit but if you want it to be do that you can have a, a half a size bigger but they are true to size the outsole it is really nice it comes with the uh, old school waffle as you can see overall I would say it is a top-notch quality innovative design and 
fun, minimalist, col minimalist colorway. The price, wow, not bad for the price. It comes with a very good quality um, suede. And uh, this one will be a, a fan favorite because of a um, versatile style and the history behind and that will be all on the unfoot sneaker review of air max one uh, thunder gray and i would love to hear your thought please leave a like it is free and it helps the channel for youtube algorithm and also i would love to hear your thought please leave a comment down below and if you haven't subscribed yet please do so and as always Jay Nolasco here. I'll see you in the next one. Hanggang salmuli. Salamat po.